Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by to check on Little Miss Ruby. It's been 72 hours since she's been home from having her front leg amputated. Um, we're starting off kind of slow, but she's gradually getting the hang of things. Um, she's still pretty sedated. She's on a quite a few different antibiotics and pain meds, inflammation, uh, for nause nauseating and uh, runny poo. So she's on a quite a few different medicines, but she's been going outside, hopping around a little bit. She actually has been able to jump onto the deck, which is really good. I had to go buy a couple of baby shirts to put on her. Because I will be taking off her bandages and I will be showing you her incisions uh, pretty soon. So if you don't like seeing that kind of stuff, I do recommend you turn away when I show you. Josie's doing really good. She had to have six teeth pulled that very next day. Now we're just trying to get Ruby in a new normal, as I like to say. She woke up with some phantom pain this morning, so that was kind of scary for her. So the leg that we amputated was due to multiple broken bones. Her bones were very, very brittle from bone cancer. So we went ahead and have that amputated. We're having it sent off to the pathologist. They're going to look it over to make sure it is bone cancer. And they also took something off of her lymph node. And we did just wanted to make sure it's not cancer, so we're not out of the woods yet. So once we get that, uh, the findings on what they get from the pathologist, I will pass it along to you guys. But hopefully there is no more cancer in that body because, because this little girl has had enough. She had the mast cell tumor, see? She had the sarcoma tumor, and now they want to say that she has bone disease, which is another, like a tumor on her bone. No, no more. This little girl deserves so much better. She is going to have the best birthday party ever. I know a lot of you had asked if you want to send a birthday card or whatever for little Miss Ruby, you can. Um, her birthday is uh, next month, which is, oh my gosh, is it June, July, August, September? September? Oh my gosh. September 7th. Ruby is going to be 14 years old. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that. She's going to be 14. Wow. So yes, I do have a P.O. box. I will uh, put it down below and I'll also put it here on the screen. If you would like to send a card or whatever you want for Little Miss Ruby, she would love that. And I will hang up all of her cards I still am collecting cards and that for my nephew. I'll be working on another video on that. But I really just wanted to uh, get Ruby's update video because I know so many of you, and I mean thousands of you. So this is her incision. They took her shoulder blade and arm. They took it all. It's all gone and it's so sad. 
but I have to keep a little shirt on her just to keep it clean. And this one I found at, I think it was Target maybe. It was really silky, but it's so long and dumpy like on her. So I got to come with or come up with a different way to make her more stylish, I guess. But she still enjoys laying out in the sun. I still take her for her car rides. Although now I have to have her, uh, the daddy, my husband, um, drive us. Because I can't drive and hold her at the same time. So we're just, you know, doing some changes here and there that will please little Miss Ruby. I did start giving her a little bit of pumpkin because she has not pooped since Sunday. So, yeah, she needs to get some of those squirts out of her. But other than that, she is doing fantastic. It's going to be a slow road. We all know, even her sisters know, they have been very, very, very clingy to little Miss Ruby. And Josie's just staring at her like, I want to play, but I know I can't, but I do. <laughs> but yeah, I wanted to do a, another update video for you guys. And just, I, I just want to say I am so, so honored to have so many amazing subscribers or like I like to call you subby friends for praying for my little girl. I know for a fact, if they, if there was no prayers and all of our prayers did not get met to the person that handles this. Okay, how about we say God and the doctor, okay? Those two needed to hear our prayer to get Ruby back home to me, her daddy, and her sisters. We all love her very, very much. And I would do anything for this little girl. Put my hands behind her, kind of set, set her up. And... Go potty. Boo Bear, you want to try to go potty, honey? Oh, oh, she's down, Matt. I'm going to pick her up on the... Come here, Boo Bear. Ruby. Ruby. She took one step. She's probably going to pee. She's probably like figure out what the hell am I going to do. Well, she might need someone to hold her hind leg and I can keep her still up top. Maybe she can go. She's probably going to resist doing it if you keep helping her. There, 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 there. Look. Oh, you're so big, honey. Look at you go. Bear, you're so strong. Oh, honey. Oh, I love you so much. I love you so much. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. You're such a good girl. Good girl, honey. Good girl. Oh, they took all your hair. <laughs> Honey, I love you. Oh, and I get kisses too. I get kisses. Oh, I got kisses. Oh, I love you too, Boozy Bear. Mommy, love you so much. I'm not leaving you at all. I'm never leaving you. No. I love you so much. Joey. Your, your sister needs some space, okay? Oh, 
Ruby, do you know there's thousands of people, thousands of people prayed for you. They all prayed for you, boo. They're all over the world. And they're all, oh, you're so big. Look at you. Oh my gosh. Good girl, Boo Bear. Oh, big girl. Her so big. Hi. Go potty. So where do you think, like, it's going to be sore right here? Oh, look, shoulder up here. Probably up on her shoulder towards her back. Okay. So she said grab her under her chest and her back legs. Okay.